Hey guys, happy Sunday. This is Marshall with Mommin' in the City. Welcome back to my channel for my returning viewers and welcome to my channel if you are new. Today we are going to be doing my first cash stuffing for February. Um, I had a lot to change with my budget. A lot has changed with um, the way that I stuff my cash envelopes and new sinking funds are being added so i just want to give you guys an update on that so we're going to go and get started i'm going to start with my actual cash envelopes and then we'll move on to my sinking funds all right so i'm going to stuff my cash envelopes and before i do that i go through whatever i have left over in my envelopes before i restuff them so in groceries left over and y'all normally never have any money left over but i really been trying to make a conscious effort to save a little bit of money so groceries has 13 dollars left over and groceries gets 150 dollars. so i'm going to take 100 20 40 50 and so now my groceries cash envelope is stuffed. Put that to the side. Next is eating out. And y'all know the struggle I have with eating out. This is my little snowball stamp card. Leave that in there. And I have $5 left. So every bit counts, right? So eating out gets $25. So, that's that. Next is gas. My husband actually put gas in the car this week on his own. He did not come to this, so I still have 20 left over, and I'm going to straighten this out once I get done with it, guys. But gas gets $20. Next is household. Household is empty and household gets $25. And I got these from Miss Kelly Budgets on Etsy. And last is spending, which is also empty. I got this from the Planning Dancer and spending gets $20. I'll link their um their Etsy shops below. And so that's spending. So those are my cash envelopes. The rest will be for my sinking funds and my different savings challenges that I'm doing. But for now, left over from my envelopes, I have 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 38. So guys, this five is going into my five dollar savings um i'm not doing a five dollar savings challenge however any fives that i'm left over with at the end of the week i'm going to put into my little five dollar savings envelope and use this to help me fund my um my different savings challenges that i'm doing so i'm not doing the actual five dollar savings challenge but this will help for the savings challenges that i am doing same for these ones i have three ones i'm not doing a one dollar savings challenge this year but any ones that i'm left over um that i have left over at the end of the week i'm gonna put this to the side to help fund my penny challenge um i'm gonna be posting a video about my uh, update on my penny challenge but just anything that's left over goes in here and that's at the end of a penny week when if i don't have enough to stuff the penny challenge i'm going to use this to help me stuff it and then this 20 will go to my emergency fund and then this 10 will go into my debt envelope so i'm going to stuff those now yeah my husband teasing me right now because my money not set up i'm gonna give me a cash uh drawer or one of those little eyeglass kits that everybody be using soon but in the meantime sorry so five dollar savings here i'm gonna go ahead and put this five in there and like i said this will go towards the savings challenges if ever i'm low on funds i can use this to help me fund my savings challenge emergency is going to be getting twenty dollars and 
ten dollars is going to debt. That's in the front. Where is my debt envelope? Um, I think it's in this one here. Yep. All right. So the extra ten is going to be going into my debt envelope and at the end of the month whatever i have left over i'll just take this and make an extra payment on my credit card so that's that for my cash envelopes time to move on to my sinking funds all right so we are back to stuff my sinking funds i've already updated my cash envelopes here next we're going to be going on to my savings challenge now for my savings challenge i've already stuffed 68 dollars. i had a total of $150 that I was stuffing. So, make sure I'm right. $150 minus 68 $82. So, we're going to be stuffing $82 into my savings challenge. I'm waiting on the envelope that I ordered for my savings challenge to come in. So, until then, I'm just putting it in this blank envelope. So, we're going to do $20, $40. Let's see. $50. 60, 70, 75, 80, 81, 82. All right, let me make sure that's right. So 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80. Put that back. 81, 82. So that is going into my savings challenge envelope. This is the envelope that I use to stuff all of my savings challenges. And speaking of that, I'm going to be doing an update on my savings challenges, um, like a report from the month of January. So that'll be coming next, guys. So savings challenge received $82. Next is Sam's Club. I'm trying to build up a bulk Sam's Club um, envelope. I don't have, I ordered that one too. So I'll put it in this envelope for now. This is something new that I'm going to be stuffing. Um, I am pregnant. My baby girl is due in May. And so I wanted to do like a really big Sam's Club grocery haul so that I don't have to worry about going back to the store. But, you know, a couple of months to give me some time. I don't really even want someone delivering things here. You know, we are in this time that we're in now. And so I just kind of want for six to eight weeks, you know, to have enough stuff stocked up so I don't have to go out and nobody, you know, has to go out and come back in and that thing. So I'm going to start saving for a Sam's bulk grocery haul. Next is my son, Cops. He's going to be getting $20. I am also waiting on his envelope to come in. So that should be coming soon. So... For now, I just put it in here. They went, um, spent some time with their auntie, so I gave them money out of their envelope so that they would have money if they went out to do things. Next is my daughter, Anne's. She's also getting $20 in her envelope. And I got these cute envelopes from um, Triple M TV. She has So So Creations Etsy shop. I'll link that down below for when she opens her shop again. I think she only does it once a month and it's normally the first two or three days of the month so we missed it for february if you haven't shopped with her but she should be back open for march next baby charisma is going to be getting twenty dollars then we have my five dollar savings which i've already put the five in now emergency even though i put the leftover twenty dollars from um, you know, my cash envelopes, I still am going to put in $10 into emergency as a normal stuffing. So anything extra I get is extra, but I just want to make sure that at least each week I'm putting in $10. So I'm putting in 10 for that one. Savings. This is for Saveopoly. We won't be doing Saveopoly until next Monday and the rest next Monday. And the rest of these are my savings challenges. So I'm going to go on to my green binder. And we're going to go to beauty first. So let's see. Um, beauty. Beauty is going to be getting $10. Then we have home. 
home is going to be getting five dollars got these savings trackers from beautiful budgets here on youtube i will link her etsy shop down below as well next is home decor which will be getting five dollars as well And then we have entertainment, which is going to be getting $10. Clothing is also going to be getting $10. I'm going to update my trackers once, I, uh, once I'm done with this off camera. I don't want the video to be too extremely long. So clothing gets 10, travel is also getting 10. Next is Bath and Body Works sales, which is getting $5. Birthdays is going to be getting $10. My sister's birthday is coming up soon. So we need to build that up. Car maintenance is getting $10. Date night is going to be getting $17. Trying to do something special for my husband before the baby comes. So I'm beefing up this um, envelope a little more. So day night gets 17. Holidays is getting 10. So I'll do two fives. Medical is getting 20. I can never keep money in medical. I'm constantly going back and forth to the doctor, paying copay and co-insurance and medications and all of that. But I do what I can. Let me lift this up. You can't see. Renewals is getting $5. And school is getting the remainder. Should be $3. I'm going to stick my little Sam's envelope. Like I said, I do have an envelope for this coming, and I will switch it out once it comes, but I'll stick this in here for now. This is for my Sam's bulk shopping. So that is it, guys. Um, anything that I've showed you, I will link the description, um, the you know, their Etsy channel or Etsy page and their YouTube channel down below. I'm trying to do something different um, as far as stuffing all of my sinking funds. Uh, my cash envelopes. I'm trying to do the savings challenge. I'm trying to get my emergency fund to a thousand dollars. So it's a lot going on this year, guys. But I'm excited about the challenge of it all. Um, I just realized that it's important to save, and I've never been a saver. I've always, always been a spender, like spend to the last penny. And I'm realizing that you know that just doesn't work. It doesn't work. Um, so guys. I also am doing a 100 envelope challenge with my sisters. I haven't talked about that yet, but I am going to update it when I do my savings challenge update for January because I did start that with my sisters and I want you guys to see about that. So comment below. Let me know if y'all are doing any savings challenges this year and like this video and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you later. Bye.